day 22 the robot has to read the new employees.xlsx to each and every employee send a welcome mail to the each employee email address this one this one this one this one and the name that's it so it's a just read range right so read range and use the for each row activity and uh, send a mail right uh, outlook so where is that uh, employee data that's what here uh, where is that employee data Where we have employee data? Employee. Uh, let's open the uh, let me check. Okay, so do we have a day twenty uh twenty-two folder here? Day twenty-two folder. Where is Excel? Excel, do you have Excel? Do you have Excel and courses Excel? Welcome is there, okay. Maybe that is. This is Excel, okay. Let's download, okay. Okay. Now we have Excel, uh, new employees. Where is that new employees? New employees Excel is there, okay. In this new employees Excel, uh, you have a data. Uh, like this right uh, like this so you have a data like uh, uh, these are all the data right what we have to do so just use the read range that's it right so just use a uh, comment excel application scope browser excel from the desktop that's a new employees.xlsx and read range what is the sheet name read range and sheet name is a sheet one only okay keep it as it is and uh, create a data table like a employee uh, edt okay employee dt use a for each row activity to loop each and every row from the oof, for each row of the each and every row from the employee dt and now what is a uh, send send outlook send uh, out, out an outlook mail message so to whom we have to send so we have to send to the row of so what is the uh, name so this is a column name right row of this one row of not to send this is a two address and subject so do you do i mention any subject here uh, Subject is this one, right? Welcome to our organization. Here is your new employee ID. Okay, that is a subject. So, paste here this new employee employee ID is 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 a row of that employee. ID. So, here is Excel. Go to the Excel, and this is the employee ID. Okay, just copy this one. And go here and paste the row of that column name dot to string. Okay, and the, what is the body? Body here in the body it has a okay, so body has this one. Uh, no, no, this is the entire thing is a body, right? The entire thing is a body. Okay, what we can do, we can we can just keep that body. Uh, okay, 
So what we can do, I'm just uh, keeping that body into the one text file. Email body is a text file. But here, there is an employee name is one tag, employee ID is one tag, right? So here, I'm just using the uh, breaks years, okay? Okay, let us uh, try this one. So I'm saving the entire uh, data into this one. Uh, the body into the one text file so so that uh, tomorrow if any changes uh, is there in the body we can easily change from the uh, so around the watch so we can change from the uh, text file okay uh, read text file so just use the read text file in the drag and drop read text file this is the text file name text file name and uh, change that one into the uh, employee body body text uh, email body text okay email body text okay got it email body text what are you saying uh, imap you can try so imap if you are gmail you can try imap you can use imap mail message we can use so we already done right so imap is a very simple so if you have a see imap send imap mail messages and this is a server port number and uh, send to that uh, there's an email uh, email part uh, oh, i already discussed that in the email part we'll try uh, okay because yeah now this is a uh, send as a html body and this is a body is like a uh, email body dot replace of what is the text which is there so this email this email instead of this or tag so you can mention anything, right? Just mention the uh, less than and the name. So that's not required the, to identification, to make unique thing, okay, that's it. Row of, instead of this, this name. And again, replace, replace, Replace off again one more uh, tag is like a mention here on comma row of employee ID. Not too string. Okay. So that's it. So it will just send us a body. And uh, as another thing, so there's uh, some attachments I'm seeing here uh, in the requirement. So where is that requirement? There's uh, attach the welcome slash this folder name. Okay, so let us try to download this uh, this Suresh, this things in there thing. Okay. Uh, let's try to download the welcome folder itself. It has a, it has a, uh, that mean offer letter for the Ramesh Suresh, uh, Rajesh is there, offer letter. Uh, and that offer letter, uh, we have to download, I mean, we have to attach to the same mail. So let us download to this uh, folder. Go to here and create your own folder, like a attach offer letter, of course and uh, drag this one here of first extract this here 
you have this folder within this folder I'm just copying this entire folder see the here the attachments create attachment the attachment up to this is a common up to this welcome is common so after that uh, some suresh dot doc x right this is a suresh dot doc x is coming this suresh dot doc x make a b a rajesh or okay ramesh but that names are there in the name name column okay so take that name column here append that name column instead of that uh, row of name dot to string okay that's it so it will attach to that one so let's run we'll see whether it will, is working fine or not yeah it's it seems it's work fine so without any errors let us see we'll get any mail or not okay so i have one mail attached here so one is a, another gmail gmail is there okay old new okay here uh not here where is that this one see so welcome it's coming right so it's coming elkin organization so here is your image and the same time if you go here oh where is that uh, my mail is that mail is there some Ramesh as UA path learner at gmail.com gmail.com so that will come okay let's wait okay now you can see here there's an attachment is a Ramesh dot Ramesh dot uh, document okay this has a Ramesh dot document dear Ramesh dear Ramesh here is your attachment Good. this is how you can do this exercise okay and this this having the uh, your employee id and your email name rajesh rajesh for rajesh it is a rajesh for suresh it is a suresh got it so if you want to mode there is no no new lines right so what you can do you can go to that uh, particular place so where is that your your text file the text file open this text file and introduce these breaks whenever you want breaks breaks your yeah, break break your yeah, two more breaks two more breaks break here yeah. and if you want to or something like a bold color you can just introduce something like a c here b b is a bold okay b is a bold those the these are all the html tags okay if you want to name is like a b bold color or h1 so h1 is a headers okay uh, your employee name is a h1 so welcome your employee name is a h1 these things you can mention here okay the html tags you mention in the this head text file okay now if i run let, let me run again See now we got another mail having the proper things right see here the html the html is applied here okay welcome to uh, welcome rajesh so go to the send mail so you can see see here this is for uh, suresh this is for ramesh this is for rajesh got it so this is how you can you have to send mail so i map that is a simple thing so imap is a get uh, so, uh no, it's not imap 
okay smtp so if you want to send uh, uh, see so you said some people said uh, imap right so imap is only to get the mails okay send smtp mail messages okay we just use a, a smtp mail so everything is a common except that uh, you have to provide the uh, this port number and uh, server name so okay smtp.gmail.com right just try with the smtp so smtp here having this one so smtp port number is a 465 okay and your username and password email and password where we are you are sending so don't forget to give this one send email id and from from address also and the two address subject body everything is the same got it try with the smtp not imap imap is only to download the mails so this is the access uh couple okay this is how any doubts in this 22 day 22 access okay do you have any doubts or others so, so any doubts uh, today's class under this xsc i got a mail suresh mail welcome suresh so there's old one okay yeah new one is in the in the on the way 